Like the art gallery inside the center on Colfax, much of how we tackle equality is a work in progress, yes. Joe Foster with the center is no stranger to it. While the facility has made strides supporting the LGBTQ plus community in Denver, the fight isn't over. You know, Colorado and Denver especially have come a long way since being known as the hate state. But yes, there is a lot more work that needs to be done. A lot of our people in our community still don't have access to the proper mental health care that they need. So there's still some work to do. This week, the Human Rights Campaign released its annual Municipal Equality Index. The list shows how inclusive municipal laws, policies and services are to the LGBTQ community. Boulder, Fort Collins and Denver all got perfect scores. What's great about these reports that holds our elected officials accountable. So what it tells me is that our elected officials are listening. One policy Foster pointed out was the single person restroom signage. In 2016, Denver passed a law that requires all single person bathrooms to be gender neutral. Small steps, Foster says, Denver and cities alike can't stop making things like these reports or you know certain milestones in our movement whether it be marriage equality or just having the right to work but without fear of losing your job those are just pit stops on the road to full equality a road some have traveled for decades but it's one that has stops worth celebrating i think it's fair to say that denver is able to give themselves a little bit of a pat on the back uh, for the work that they have done so far Jalisa Rosari, 9 News.